Webb almost ready to explore the solar system. At the end of a cave or in a remote place when the power goes out, suddenly we know true darkness. But there is usually a faint glow coming from somewhere. Even the night sky never looks totally black, since there are usually one or two stars shining in the distance. It's hard to imagine a time when all that existed was darkness. An infinite place where the only thing that prevailed was emptiness. When you could travel in any direction for millions of years and see absolutely nothing. And that is the story that scientists tell us. The story of the dark ages that reigned in the universe before the first stars were lit. And today, in 2022, they intend to show us that era. Or rather to show us how the cosmos was finally filled with light. Can you imagine how they'll be able to achieve such a feat? Yes, with the largest telescope ever placed outside the Earth, the incredible James Webb Space Telescope. Humankind has always looked to the sky for meaning, but as our yearning for knowledge has delved deeper into the depths of space, the search becomes the answer to the questions. Who are we? How far will we go? If you're looking for the truth, like, subscribe, click the bell icon, join us. This is what the world needs. Let's discover the answers together. Equipped with a 6.5 meter wide mirror and four extremely high sensitivity instruments, Webb will focus on a very small area of the sky for days trying to detect light that has been traveling through the vastness of space for more than 13.5 billion years. Yes, it's a shocking idea that you can witness something like that, but that is the consequence of light having a finite speed in a vast and expanding cosmos. If you look deeper, you should eventually come to collect the light from the pioneering stars as they clustered into the first galaxies. As NASA's space agency's James Webb Space Telescope moves into the final stages of commissioning its scientific instruments, in parallel, the agency has begun work on the technical operations of this marvelous and revolutionary observatory. As the telescope moves through space, it'll constantly find distant stars and galaxies and point them with extreme precision to acquire images and spectra. However, NASA has also set out to observe planets their satellites, asteroids, and comets in our own solar system, moving through the background stars of our galaxy. Let's take a look at the James Webb's first big discovery below, and learn what happened when the telescope recently completed the first test to track moving objects with some truly revolutionary and wonderful results. The great discovery of the James Webb Space Telescope was achieved when the Webb team recently completed their first test to track moving objects. A test that being successful is considered a great discovery of the capabilities that has the incredible James Webb, whose fabulous result is that it was verified that it could perform scientific and study in-depth moving objects. Let's remember that the Webb Telescope is practically ready, and while slight test adjustments are being carried out, Multiple tests have been performed, observing and analyzing from the same James Webb telescope other objects that move at various speeds. Verifying NASA scientists that you can study objects totally in motion through the telescope throughout our solar system, which is wonderful news for the great value it has for the enigmas of the planets closest to our planet Earth are revealed. This new great self-discovery of the James Webb is only possible due to advanced and microelectronics, increased processor power, and new telecommunications, or remote communications technologies. Innovations that will allow NASA and the James Webb team of scientists to detect the faint light of the first galaxies, but above all to observe with a precision never seen before objects that are much closer to our planet Earth something that will begin to be known immediately and of which impressive results are expected in the first year of operations of the James Webb, a period in which it is assured that some of the mysteries that abound in our own solar system can be unraveled. A powerful telescope like the James Webb is necessary and fundamental to study our nearby solar system 
because it will allow science to complete, expand, and enrich the data obtained by observations from various telescopes operating from planet Earth and other technological tools of astronomy. For example, with the James Webb Telescope, we will learn more about the planet Mars and the distant ice giants and Neptune. And the James Webb will also be used to make measurements of large populations of objects such as hundreds of asteroids or objects in the Kuiper Belt. In the context of this major announcement, NASA reported that the James Webb team has already used an asteroid within our solar system to perform engineering tests on its ability to study, analyze, and measure moving objects. NASA recognizes that our own solar system has many more mysteries than its team of scientists have time to solve. So, the James Webb is already and will continue to image the giant planets and Saturn's rings, explore many objects in the Kuiper Belt, analyze the atmosphere of Mars, and perform detailed studies of Titan, the Moon, and the Moon's atmosphere. We'll perform detailed studies of Saturn's moon Titan and much more with extensive schedule of studies and observations. Because the priority of the James Webb is to study the confines of the universe in its origin. So it is estimated that, in its first year of operation, the James Webb will only use 7% of its time in the study of objects close to our solar system. This discovery is the operational capacity of the James Webb, and all this program of observation of planets and objects near our solar system is very helpful and interesting. As reported by NASA, there is evidence from the Hubble Space Telescope that Jupiter's moon Europa has sporadic columns of water-rich material, which is why it's already planned to take high-resolution images of the moon Europa and study its surface and look for some kind of activity that can be measured. With the images that are recorded, in-depth analysis will be carried out with the James Webb Spectrum Graph technology to analyze the composition of everything that is recorded. It will observe almost everything there is to see beyond Earth, from icy moons and comets in our own solar system, to the colossal black holes that reside at the center of all galaxies. It is expected to be particularly well-suited to study planets orbiting other suns. The James Webb Telescope, which cost 10 billion US dollars and took three decades to build, lifted off from Earth on December 25th, 2021, and has successfully embarked on its mission to search for the first stars that lit up the cosmos. Who would have thought, today, we may be one of the few existing species that are aware of the universe and its existence? a species willing to explore and unravel the great mysteries of the cosmos. Today, as researchers or spectators, we should feel fortunate to be witnessing an era of breakthroughs, discoveries, and many answers. Answers that will take humanity further than it ever thought possible. After all, that is what the James Webb will explore. Our origins and the dust of those stars that created what we are today. If you're looking for the truth, like, subscribe, click the bell icon. Join us. Leave in comments what you think about the amazing telescope that will change the way we see the universe. This is what the world needs. See you next time.